Good morning everyone. Um, welcome to Reasons to Worship on a Monday, number two. Today's reason is God is our helper. So I have a very busy mind. Um, there's, there's always stuff going on. I'm a parent. Um, um, I have a job. There's, there's things around the house to do. There's just so much. Um, there's lots of people and friends and family in my life. A lot of things for me to give my time to. And on occasions I've, I've felt such stress in my head um, and just really I felt overwhelmed by it at times. And those times though, it's also the times I've felt um, less secure in my self-worth and, and I maybe forgotten who I am in Christ. And when I've brought those things back to Jesus, I've had this wonderful sense of God being my helper and, and he's told me, I'll help you. There's been times when I've thought oh, I've got to do this. I've got, you know, I've got to cut, I'm going to cut the hedge later this week, or um, paint this, or, or cook that. And Jesus has been there saying, "I'll be doing that with you." And I just want to remind us all of that this morning. That um, don't forget, Jesus will do these things with us. But let's pray and ask Him for help. You know, it's we can ask God for help on our way to work, thinking of the day ahead of us. Um, cooking the tea, all these things that we do in our lives. God is our helper. Psalm 54 says, Surely God is my help. The Lord is the one who sustains me. So that is a reason to look forward to this week ahead, knowing that Jesus walks with us. Mm. He says he will not leave us or forsake us. In Psalm 31 it says, How great is your goodness, which you have stored up for those who fear you. God is our protector and our helper. So that's the reason for um, for us to go face this week, this morning. We are not alone. We can do these things um, with Jesus. I can do all things through him who gives me strength. And would you pray? Soon? Yeah, I'll pray. Lord, we thank you so much that today you are God. You reign every day in the past, right now, and in the future. You reign. You're seated on the throne. Mm. And Lord, we belong to you so we can face this week we can face today knowing you are our helper you are all we need Lord Jesus and so we want to bring you our lives we want to bring you today and we want to worship you and thank you for your goodness to us mm. your faithfulness Lord we do not deserve it but we praise you today our reason to worship you today amongst others is that you are our helper and what mm. a wonderful helper the God of heaven and earth who made all things you are our helper Mm. And we praise you and we thank you. Amen. Amen. So we're going to sing this song. It's called Our Helper, Jesus Christ. And Sue wrote this song. Um, since I heard it, uh, it's it's this line, Our Helper, you are our helper, God, our protector. And and to me, that is, I look to God for that, for, my, for being my helper. Um, so let's worship. Let's worship him together.
and victory now is yours. We've seen in our lives and in your word, each promise you make is sure. You've sent your son to die for us, he suffered upon the cross. Death could not defeat the Holy One. with us this week 
so that whatever we do, whether in word or deed, we can do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus. For you are with us each day. Thank you for that relationship we have through the blood of Jesus. We are thankful and grateful and so, so happy that you are going to be with us in each thing. So I just pray for your week, whoever's watching this, that you would know that you can walk every step with Jesus and that you would cry out to him, run to him in worship and praise and thankfulness in each day. Amen. Amen.